sucks. Facebook sucks. Facebook sucks. Facebook sucks. Facebook sucks. Yes, it does. Okay, everybody. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Like outcast. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. It goes on forever. Okay. <clears throat> I, I'm on a tight schedule, guys. I got to keep rolling here, okay? So, uh, the next speaker is the co owner of the Holly Christmas Tree Farm. She found herself in the Oakland County probate court system in 2016 after her life partner of 35 years passed away. Never ever in her wildest dreams did she think that by 2020 she'd be getting into debates with the Attorney General Dana Nessel rubbing elbows, yeah boo, boo, no Dana Nessel, we don't like you. She, didn't, she had no idea she'd be rubbing elbows with Supreme Court Justices, Brian Zahara, Bridget McCormick. She frequently speaks for the 21 Oakland County Commissioners and has pleaded with state senators in the Judiciary Committee asking, committee asking them why she does not get her day in court. While grieving, she still single-handedly uncovered a corruption ring of racketeering Michigan judges and their co-conspirators, the attorneys, who are stealing justice. Boo! Oh. Oh. She isn't taking this fight laying down, just like the rest of us. So I want you to please welcome this strong freedom fighter, Victoria McCasey. Thank you, Kevin. State of Michigan is on fire, and you people alone have the hose, and you don't know it. Because our state officials, I don't care if they're Republican, Democrat, they're criminals. They are out for your assets. They have absolutely drank the Kool-Aid, and they want you to join in. We are not going to stand for their nonsense anymore. We want to take back our state. And we want these criminals locked up. And we're going to start with the governor, the attorney general. We're going to go to the court, the Supreme Court. We need to go and have all the people that were just voting for the criminals they have now incorporated hospitals, nursing homes, social security, social services, and their own nice spots. We need to stand together, and we need to wake up and turn the key on and get rid of these criminals. I am not Please, stand up, start looking around. 
that and everything else. Bring it back on. Let's hear a couple of 30 more seconds. <laughs> So the next speaker is a founding father of the American Patriot Council. He's been in the fight since the beginning of all this madness on the front lines. A true American Patriot calling for accountability from the legislature. Please welcome Mr. Jason Howland. What's going on? It's each and every one of you. Give yourselves a big round of applause, Michigan! So, first, I'd like to start by saying, uh, you know, I'm humbled and thankful to Jesus for giving me the honor of saying his name here today. Just being able to say it as small and insignificant as I am. So, thank you, Jesus. So, they got me drunk, right? I think my founders knew a little something when they, when they coined that phrase and put it on our money and made it a motto for America. In God 